Hi, my name is Jared Davies with Hernstein Kia, and this is my dream car, the 2018 Kia Stinger GT2 all-wheel drive. I love the way this car looks in the front end. The headlights are LED, auto high beam, so they'll automatically turn off and on. And they're dynamic bending also, so they'll turn with the road as you go around the corners, so you can see a little bit better. The turn signals are just designed really, really nice. They match along with the honeycomb grill. And the vents here in the front are actually functional as well. You pop the hood. It has a 3.3 liter twin turbo gas direct injected engine pushing 365 horsepower, 376 foot pound of torque. It's got an eight speed automatic transmission. This car will do zero to sexy and 60 in 4.7 seconds. That's a full second faster than the Audi A5 Sportback. In AMCI testing, this car outperformed the BMW 640i, M Sport, and everything. The slalom, zero to 60, and it overall cornering performance. It's, this car is just, it's insane, and for the price, it's, you can't touch it. We move around to the side, I love the way the car looks, how sleek it is. Everything's just nice and smooth. But on the side, they've got this car built for safety, your family in mind. Side impact steel beams, side curtain airbags, side airbags, and it's got a ton of space in the back for car seat. Something I look for, because my son's two, he's still rear facing and you can get a rear facing car seat in this no problem it's got the latch system down here where it's easily noticeable where you just click this back and then you just plug your seat right in there makes it nice and easy hook it to the back of the seat it's got a 10 year 100,000 mile powertrain warranty five year 60,000 mile limited basic warranty and five year 60,000 mile roadside assistance so you don't ever have to worry about anything when you're driving this car on a long trip, which that's what this car was built for. You come around to the back, it has LED tail lights. It looks very, very good with the, the dual twin exhaust with the chrome tips. It has a smart power lift gate. So as long as this vehicle is locked, all you have to do is walk up to the car, stand here for a second. It'll automatically open. You don't have to touch anything as long as you have the key in your pocket. There's power lift gate. So it'll come right open. You can remove this, it has tons of storage space. The rear seats are 60-40 split, so you can lay those down as well to get as much as you need in here. If you lift this up, this one does have a spare tire. Underneath the spare tire is where the battery is located back here in the rear. Just press that button, that'll lower back. If we move around here, pop in the side here I like to drive with my seat really far back I'm a slightly bigger dude I need my space when I'm driving I can get in behind myself with no issues and still be very comfortable the seats are nice and long you fit in here really well you have a center armrest with cup holders a rapid charging USB port and a 12 volt outlet you even have vents back here you can control hot or cold if you wanted to so that your passengers can be comfortable in this car along with you this car has 19 inch alloy wheels with michelin pilot summer tires brembo brakes um, the side vents here are actually fun functional as well to help vent that the mirrors I love the, the the dark chrome black chrome that is on these it matches with the front grille and they look really nice these were designed to be aerodynamic they're also auto dimming so that's something you don't see in a lot of cars if somebody's behind you with their bright lights on you don't have to worry about it those will dim down help keep the light out of your eyes it also has smart welcome so when you walk up to this car at night, the mirrors will automatically fold out, lights will come on, puddle lights will come on. It helps you see to be able to get in if you're in a dark parking lot or a dark area. But we'll hop in, take a look, see what's in here. The seats are with Napa leather. 
So they're really soft to the touch. The driver's seat is a 16-way power driver's seat. So you can adjust it forward, backwards, the back, lumbar support. But this here, you can actually adjust the bolstering in the seat. You can make it tighter, you can make it looser, help squeeze you if you need to when you're taking those tight corners. This section here will actually make this part scoot out and scoot in. So if you wanted to make the seat a little bit longer, more comfortable, or if you needed it a little bit shorter, depending on how your legs are, you can adjust the seat in so many ways, it's gonna be impossible to not be comfortable in this car. If you hop in here, take a look. Everything is just so nicely laid out. It's easy to reach. You rest your arm right here. You can reach your shifter. Your controls for your heated, ventilated seats are right here. Your heated steering wheel. Parking sensors, front and rear, if you wanted to turn those off. Your auto stop. Right here is for your drive modes. We'll turn it on. You can switch through this mode here. And you have five different drive modes. You have custom, sport, comfort, eco, and smart. So you can do a wide range of things in this vehicle. And also when you start it, the steering wheel automatically come down to your position that you have it set to. It's powered, it's telescoping and tilt. Um, right here you have an auto hold for your brake. So if you're driving in traffic, you're stopping and going a whole lot, get stuck at a red light, you're tired, you just got off work, you just press it in on the brake pedal just a little bit, it'll hold the brake, you can let off, sit, and relax while you're while you're sitting there and then as soon as you go to take off you just press the gas it'll let off the brake you can go it has advanced smart cruise control also which is one of my favorite things because when you're going on a long trip you just get on the highway set the cruise to whatever you want it'll automatically slow down with the traffic in front of you so if somebody's in trouble in front of you it has sensors it'll keep you a safe distance from the person in front of you and if they even come to a complete stop it'll come to a stop and then once they take off, you just hit the plus sign on the cruise control. It'll take you right back up to the speed that you had set to or to the speed that the person in front of you is doing. You have heads up display, which displays information on the windshield. So you can see nice and clear so you're not being distracted. You're not looking down as you're driving. You can just stare out the windshield and still be able to see your speed and your lanes and all of that good stuff. It has lane departure warning. It has blind spot monitoring. It has lane keep assist it has um oh shoot i just messed it all up <laughs> it has a uh, rear cross traffic alert with your backup camera it has pedestrian watch with autonomous emergency braking and then in here you have an 8.4 inch touchscreen with navigation with voice control you have a 15 speaker Harman Kardon premium sound system. And yeah, this car has everything. Um, this car is a true Gran Turismo that you need to come in, you need to drive it, you need to sit in it, you need to see this car in person. It's not one that you can look at on YouTube. And, and I mean, you can do that and fall in love with it, but when you get in this car and experience it, you're gonna fall even more in love with it and you're not gonna wanna live without this car. So come down here, Kernstein Kia, ask for me, Jared. I'd love to take you out in this, show you it, let you drive it and, and spend some time and make you fall in love with this car as well. Thank you.